Last week, we visited the General Motors Technical Center to look at their Aero X, GM's marriage of convenience between aerodynamics and the family sedan. But GM isn't the only car maker promoting this matchup. Let's wander over now to the Ford Design Center. We're going to see how Ford is handling this rather delicate union of space science and family comfort. Ford's solution to the aerodynamic riddle is called the Probe One. This all-steel and glass body is based on the Mustang chassis, though the body itself is a radical departure from the usual upright Ford style. The design is Ford's attempt to make the most of current aerodynamic knowledge and techniques while avoiding impractical pencil-thin designs. There was a lot of wind tunnel research done on the Probe 1, both by Ford and by independent researchers at the University of Maryland. The result is an extremely clean body that still has room for four adults. The Probe 1 has a significantly lower drag coefficient than any previous Ford. It slips through the air with a CD of about .25. Compare that number to the standard Mustang CD of .39, and the Mustang is considered to be pretty clean by itself. Obviously, Ford is onto something here. But low CD numbers don't mean a whole lot unless they have a practical application. In this case, you can apply them to raising gas mileage. The average sedan uses two-thirds of its energy at 55 miles per hour just to push itself through the air. But the probe doesn't use nearly that much, so it gets significantly better mileage. At 55, the probe gets an estimated 39 miles to the gallon. A regular Mustang with the same engine gets only about 32. But Ford is probing even further. Probe 1 begot probes 2 and 3, both of which have even better CD numbers. Like GM's Aero X, the probe won't be sitting in any new car showrooms anytime soon. But Ford's designers are good students. Many of the lessons learned in the probe project have been applied to the 1983 Thunderbird. And we'll see the results of those applications in just a few minutes. <laughs>